Hi, welcome to another Kevy Shaves. Today's shave, I'm going with the Micro Progress on setting three. Uh, and the blade I have in that today is the Gillette seven o'clock. Which I think they're, I think they're the green, are they? I don't know. That's the second use on that blade. Uh, the brush today is the the big still and the big still and Kong, you know. I'm going to lather that boy's face up easy. Uh, and because today is Tuesday, I'm going with tobacco. And I'm just going to rub in. I've got some, I actually got this sent to me from um, Gus. Thank you, Gus, quite a while back. And I've, I've not used it that much, so I'm going to try it today. This is the PA, uh, the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Pre Shave Bar. Uh, so I'm just going to wet my face a bit and then we'll ooh, rub that in. It's slippy. <laughs> okay, that'll do. And I'm just so I'll just rub it in a little bit. It's good. And then I'll put the blade in there, the razor to get some heat. And the soap's been blooming, so I just take the water out, wet the brush, and then we'll load the brush. This is actually, I've had this tobacco for a while and I've never used it. So I just thought, um, because it's a Tuesday, Tobacco Tuesday, you always see it in the shapes of the day pictures, Tobacco Tuesday, so yeah, it's there, why not? Uh, for anyone who doesn't know about tobacco, it's, um, yeah, it's a, a kind of, bit of a vintage soap. It's been on the go for a lot of years and it smells like tobacco. Not like horrible stale tobacco, but just a nice manly tobacco scent. Some people like it, some people hate it. <laughs> I think it's okay, I'm a bit of a, a, traditional when it, a traditionalist when it comes to things like that. I kind of like things that have been around for a lot of years. Well, I like it, so yeah, I'm going to use it. Okay, and we have an absolute ton of suds. And there's still a ton in there. I'm just going to skip some of that out and I'll put it on my face. And we'll get the lather going. Just a little dry, so I'm just going to dip the tips of it in. How is everyone? Good, I hope you've been having some good shaves and stuff. Um, yeah, uh, the last shave I had, I didn't film it. 
and I, I put the a, a bowl lathered and I put the bowl with the the lather in it I put it into another bowl filled with hot water so I had hot lather oh man I'm getting a scuttle when they come here I think the Crown King ones are, are uh, coming to the UK soon so I think I'm going to purchase one of those because um, it's nice to have warm lather <laughs> especially here in Scotland because it's getting cold and I'm really cold so it's nice. Okay let's get the shave going on. Merker progress on setting three and with tobacco. I've got about two days growth here. There's a pharmacy store here in the UK called Boots um, and that usually does, uh, it's always got tobacco products um, on, they always do like nice special offers on the aftershaves and the, the um, deodorant sticks and stuff like that but they never seem to sell the soap. Um, I don't know why, it's maybe a, a bit more expensive. rinse off and I'll be back. Okay. Yeah, it's a little dry. I'm just uh, dipping the brush in the water because it was just a bit dry, but it can take plenty of water so it's fine.
Okay, second pass. Across the grid. You can really hear the, um, I don't know if it's coming across on the video, but you can really hear the audible feedback from this uh, the Merkur Progress, especially going across the green. But I won't go across the green this way down here because I always get irritation there and um, I always play it safe and just go that way because that's the way my hair grows. So. Um, but it doesn't usually cause any problems. Just kind of anything sort of below that line. the uh, slickness of the soap. Yeah, it's good. Yep. Okay, I'll just rinse off and I'll be back for the third pass. Okay, the pass. I hope everyone's well and it's not too cold where you are in the world. January is a crap month, isn't it? January. It's always there's nothing happening. It's Christmas and New Year's came and went. Back to work. Mm. Well, at least you can still have some nice shaves, which is great to, to lift your spirits. <laughs> okay. Or pass. Yeah, I'm just trying to master that um, Paul H technique on the moustache where he kind of goes in that way and then kind of turns the blade as he gets towards his nostril, but um, it's not easy. <laughs> Every time I do it, I think I'm going to cut myself. <laughs> so you know what's going to happen here, don't you? Okay.
I just got a little bit on that. Just a play Adam's apple there. Okay, that's the third pass done. Yeah, very good. A little couple of bits to pick up, which I'll do eventually. I'll have a rinse and then I'll come back. Okay, wow, that's pretty close. There's a couple of bits down here, I can feel. A bit here, not much though. Mustache area is not too bad. Okay, uh, I'll just scoop what's left in here and uh, I'll do the next shaves technique. <laughs> okay, there's just a little bit here. Okay, yep, I'm pretty happy with that. Just gonna rub the rest of that soap in. Get some tobacco goodness into my skin that's freshly shaved. <laughs> yeah, nice shave. Okay, I'll just rinse off with some hot and cold and I'll be back. Wow, that feels amazing. Really nice post shave feel as well. Okay, I'm gonna put some Thayer's Cucumber Witch Hazel on. Just to... Oh, that's lovely. I hope you're having some good shaves as I am because that feels amazing, really nice. And you can really smell the cucumber in the, in the Thayer's Cucumber Witch Hazel, it's, um, it's a nice scent, it's uh, very refreshing after a shave on your skin. I want to I want to try the um, the lemon one. So I like a kind of citrusy scents. So I want to get that too. Okay, just um, while that's drying in, we'll go over what we used today. We used the Merker Progress on setting. I don't know if that's picking up with the camera, is it? Where are we? There we go. Setting three. And the blade that was in that was a Gillette 7 o'clock Permasharp stainless. And that was the second use on that blade. And we started the shave off with some very slippery <laughs> PAA um, pre-shave, the scentless bar. Uh, the brush we used today was the Sterling Kong. And uh, you can see it there. Uh, the soap was back because it's Tuesday. I'm just going to rinse my hands off. And I'm going to finish it off with guess what aftershave. Can you guess? You got it right. Tobacco. <laughs> well, it's Tobacco Tuesday, so why not? Just a little bit. Oh, a nice sting. Ah, I love that smell. It's just a nice, manly, clean smell. And I'm going to finish it off with some Nivea Men cream just to lock the aftershave in just a touch.
a little bit more actually. Just on my neck. That smells great with the tabac. Really nice. Oh, nice shave. Superb. Very, very smooth. Very close. Great. Okay, that's it from me. Thanks again for watching. Uh, I really appreciate you guys sticking with this. If you've came this far right to the end, well done you and well done me because I've kept you interested. Uh, <clears throat> as I've said before, there's hundreds of shaving videos out there, so I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch me shave. Uh, until the next time, we'll see you again and take care.